If you look at the observable universe, which is the piece of the universe and beyond, indeed, that we are claiming to understand and are indeed understanding in detail, and you realize that maps like this show you there are 350 billion large galaxies in the observable universe, which is 90 billion light years across, and we claim to understand how all that interacts, what it's made of, and indeed where it came from. And I think the size of our quest, the almost hubristic nature, becomes quite obvious. I mean, the numbers are really quite ridiculous. The universe is big, I suppose, is what I'm trying to say. In 1823, German astronomer Heinrich Olber suggested a static universe, proposing that if it's infinite and filled with stars at different distances, every sightline should reach a star. If the universe is infinite with countless bright objects, the night sky should be bright, not dark. This contradiction is known as Olber's paradox and puzzled scientists for decades. Edwin Hubble's observations a century later confirmed an expanding universe, resolving Olber's paradox. Modern astronomy dismisses the static universe concept, but a new question arises. What's the size of the universe? The estimated diameter of the observable universe is about 93 billion light years. According to physicist Brian Cox, within this vast expanse, there could be as many as 2 trillion galaxies. Join us today as we explore the mind boggling scale of the universe that might leave you astounded. Humans have an innate drive for knowledge, and understanding our environment has propelled us to the advanced stage of development we've reached today. Despite continuous technological advancements, numerous aspects of our reality remain largely unknown. These mysteries prompt questions among experts, yet the fascination they generate is undeniable. The intrigue intensifies when exploring fields that seem to surpass our understanding. Despite numerous space missions and the historic moon landing in 1969, our knowledge of the vastness of space remains limited. When we look up at the vast starry sky at night, it's evident how small we are compared to the universe. The twinkling stars in the sky indicate that our home planet is just a tiny part of what we call the universe. Even a quick look at the sky suggests that the universe must be larger than our imagination can grasp. But can we scientifically comprehend the exact size of the universe? This question has always been a key focus in cosmological research. It's possible that this question may never be fully answered. Nevertheless, experts continue to attempt an answer. Currently, we understand that the universe as we know it today came into existence around 13.8 billion years ago. The Big Bang, describing the formation of matter, space, and time from a previous singularity, is considered the birth of our universe. In physical cosmology, the cosmic microwave background radiation is crucial for studying the earliest state of the universe. This radiation, in the microwave range, originated during the Big Bang and still exists throughout the vast reaches of the galaxy today. Using various measurements that analyze radiation and relate it to different distances, researchers have managed to estimate the age of our universe. This also means that we can currently observe space up to approximately 13.8 billion light years from Earth. To visualize this, imagine a spherical drawing with Earth at the center. The rest of the sphere represents the region visible from our planet. Technically, this visible universe is termed the event horizon. Specifically, the event horizon encompasses objects whose reflected light we can barely see from Earth. Processes occurring beyond this event horizon are currently entirely invisible to us, as we are uncertain about what lies beyond the observable universe. Determining the overall size of the universe becomes even more challenging. When considering the entirety of the universe, it is crucial to acknowledge the expansion of the universe as an essential factor. As experts now understand, the universe is continually expanding. During the Big Bang, an object was about 13.8 billion light years away from Earth, but due to space's expansion, that celestial body is now approximately 46 billion light years distant. This expansion means that, in the future, we will discover objects in the sky currently unseen. Simultaneously, some celestial bodies will vanish from our star charts due to the universe's ongoing expansion. In our observations, 
Earth is placed at the center simply because of spatial constraints. We don't have another option but to designate our home planet as the central reference point. However, pinpointing the geographical location of our blue home planet within the ever-growing universe remains impossible today. Despite challenges, international teams of experts regularly strive to explore the vast dimensions of space, as mentioned earlier. To achieve this, experts employ various methods to explore the vast dimensions of the universe. Key research techniques involve specific measurements that examine the radiation from the early universe. By analyzing these radiation patterns, scientists can calculate different distances and attempt to quantify the size of the universe. The oldest known light source identified using this method is situated 92 billion light years away from Earth. However, determining whether this located object is the outermost component of the universe is more challenging than one might initially think. The question of whether the universe has an endpoint is complex. Essentially, the farther an object is from Earth, the longer it takes for the light it emits to reach us. Some objects in the galaxy are so distant that the light rays they emit can take billions of years before becoming visible from Earth. Consequently, numerous light rays in the universe are still en route to us, having traveled for billions of years without reaching Earth. Determining the shape of the universe is crucial for calculating the size of an object. The actual shape of our universe remains an unresolved question in ongoing research. Some scientists suggest it might resemble a self-contained sphere, potentially part of a larger multiverse. Conversely, others argue for a flat and infinite universe. If we lean toward the first idea, our universe would be a contained structure with an endpoint. In this scenario, theoretically, experts could mathematically determine the universe's dimensions if they had the necessary data. However, if our universe is infinite, sizing becomes an unanswerable question. Infinite objects, by definition, lack boundary points for a mathematical explanation of size. According to NASA, the universe is a flat construct that is infinitely large. Despite this, our universe has a finite age, created approximately 13.8 billion years ago. Consequently, our investigations are confined to the time span between the Big Bang and today, leaving the question of the universe's overall size unanswered. While international teams of experts may not currently know the exact size of the universe, they can assert that it is immensely vast, possibly even infinite, surpassing all our horizons with its colossal dimensions. The detailed exploration of the universe is a task that will span numerous generations of experts. Although we may never fully grasp the precise enormity of the universe in our lifetime, this fact doesn't diminish our fascination with the captivating world of distant stars and planets. Exploring the universe is an ongoing challenge for scientists. Despite not knowing the exact size, they're sure it's huge, maybe even endless. This exploration involves many generations of experts. Even if we won't fully understand the universe's size in our lifetime, our interest in distant stars and planets remains strong. The journey to understand the universe is a continuous effort. With advancing technology, scientists use telescopes, satellites, and probes to learn more about galaxies, stars, and space-time. Each step forward brings us closer to solving the mysteries of the cosmos. One big puzzle is the possibility that the universe is infinite. This idea challenges our understanding of space and raises deep questions about existence. It pushes us to think about reality beyond what we can see. As we go deeper into space, the idea of countless galaxies, each with billions of stars and planets, becomes real. The vastness of this cosmic scene, with its celestial bodies moving in a grand cosmic dance, captures our imagination. The universe, with its massive scale, makes us reflect on our place in it. We're small beings in a tiny part of the cosmos, but our drive to understand shows the human spirit's hunger for knowledge. It's a sign of our collective effort to unlock the secrets hidden in space. While we may not know the exact size of the universe, exploring it goes beyond numbers. It lets us think about big questions. Where did it all come from? What's our purpose? And what's the fate of the cosmos? The quest for knowledge is also a journey of self-discovery 
making us ponder our existence in this huge and mysterious cosmic place. As we explore, curiosity is passed from one generation to the next. What we learn becomes the base for new discoveries. Our understanding grows over time. Looking at the night sky and admiring the distant stars, we remember that our understanding of the universe is just a moment in time. The universe, with its timeless beauty, is a stage for the stories of many galaxies. Our interest in stars and planets stays strong. Even if we can't figure out all the details of the universe's size, the exploration keeps our curiosity alive. It inspires future generations to keep looking up and uncover the mysteries waiting in space. What's your take on the actual size of the universe? Do you see it as a closed entity or an endlessly vast construct? Share your thoughts on this topic in the comments. Thanks, and see you next time.